Hey guys, today on Black Ops Video Game Reviews, we're gonna do something a little different. It has been a while since I've been on here, so let me just show you. This is my um, Sega Genesis playable like um, thing. Let me just yeah, this is like a portable game player you can bring with you. Like if you wanna play like old Genesis games. With you wherever you go, well, this is well the thing for you. It has multiple games you can play. Here are the buttons. It's the start button. It's the menu. This is like a little game moving pad. And here's like a sound speaker that comes out. And then there's like a hanging thing right here where you can hang a little charm or something. Yeah, and then there's the batteries. You can charge it if you want to, so yeah, there you go. Um, and this is the battery, like if it's low battery, it blinks, so you could show that. Here's where the earphones go, in case you want to put your earphones in. And so, um, here's the switch. It's the switch. Let me just open it up for you. So, this is how it goes, the end games. And here's a few games on here you can play, like... I don't know if you know, I don't usually play any of these games. Um, this one kind of scares me. It's called Alex the Kid. I played it a few times, but it's okay. Next we have Alien Storm. That game is, well, okay, I guess. I haven't really played it much, but it's very boring, I guess, in my opinion. But if you like it, go right ahead. And this one is, um... I can't really read that. Blast or like that? Something Blast. Um, I guess you could play that as well. If you like that game or whatever. It has Arrow Flash. Not really one of my favorite games either. Uh, I don't know what that is, but it's sort of like a ripoff of Mario, I guess. I don't know. That one is more the sword fighting game. Yeah, some kind of sword fighting game of some sort. This is like, and this is like, this game is like, um, whatchamacallit, like, um, like, um, Jewel Master or whatever. Yeah, something like that, Jewel Master. And it's a cool game to play. Here, I'll show you the, the third one I play mostly. I'll show it to you real quick. See what the starting places look like. Yeah, here it is. I'm not going to play it. I'm just going to show you what it looks like. Here are all the levels. And you can click this one right here, the first one. Or that one with the chicken on it before. This one takes a place in the Egyptian area. You just pick... You can pick what setting you want. Do you want practice, normal, hard... And then there is this pyramid map that will show you like a little spider. It's gonna say who are you, where you get to attack him and stuff like that. Ready? And you're gonna to go against him. You have to try to beat the boss. And I haven't really baited him yet. It's very hard to do, so hopefully t if you guys have a beat this guy before, tell me how tell me how you did it. Okay. Mm. You have to come that zone. Check down. Which I don't know if that's a good game or not. Draw Master, which is a different kind of game. This is not the one I was. This is not the other one I was thinking of before. This one's a different game. I don't know why they have the same name. Here's Golden Axe. Three, two, and one. If you are a fan of that. Gain God. Dixa. The Funnel of Labyrinth. Uh, this is kind of based on the movie Labyrinth. I don't know. I played it a little bit. It's not that good. But if you like it, let me know about it. And see what you think. Champions. This one. It's a shooting game. This cap attack, which is just a 
sports game or whatever. Next we have the the kid shampoo or whatever. It's an okay game if, if you're like in the dragons stuff like that, I guess. It's kind of the same thing as um Alex the kid pretty much. Only with only with no um park scissors and all that stuff. Here's this game with a knee buzz and stuff. Uh, it's a really weird game, whatever. Here's a Mortal Kombat 2 and 3. Classic. Very fun game. Usually I play as Raiden. So, that's good to have. Oh, I should also warn you that the multi but the that the Mortal Kombat game on this thing is is the censored version it will not show blood or anything like that just to warn you guys if you wanted that here's Punzi star and Punzi star 3 Registar Shadow Dancer Samurai 3 Sonic 3D, Sonic and Knuckles, Sonic Spinball, which is a pinball game, Sonic the Hedgehog, Sonic the Hedgehog 2, Sword of Phantom, the Zeus, the Victim, Victim 2, and there's also air hockey. I'll just show you a little bit of a piece of that one. I have to admit, it's a very hard game at first, but once you get the hang of it, it is actually pretty fine. You can actually play with two players if you wanted to. I'll just show you what it looks like. Here it is. Here it is. Okay, here's Venture in Park, Black Sheep, which is like you know, just being a dog and getting rid of all the sheep, Bomber, Bottle Cap Race, Taps Race, Switch, Brain Switch, Bubbles Master, Break the Fire Line, Cannon, Checkers, and this is Chinese checkers. I don't know how to play, but um, that's what that is. And then there's chess, crossing the road. Let me just see what this one is, real quick. Oh, I forgot to mention. This is the volume right up here with the charger and this is for USB and this is put the if you want to put a portable game in. I never played any games on this one so I really have no idea if there are any games out there that I should buy but let me know. Here's um, Curling, Dino Army, Fight or Lose, it's like a dinosaur game of some sort, Flash Memory, Hex Get, Hex, uh, sub Hex Something, Hide and Seek, which is the shell game, where you set out all of the eggs, let me just pull this one up for you. So as you can see, it's a little baby dinosaur in here, and it switches around like that. See? So it's kind of like that kind of game.
hidden amber, Jack's pier, pier, another jewel master game. Oh, this is the actual jewel master game. So yeah, that actually is on here too. No power. This is kind of like um, battleship or whatever. Fossils game. Mr. Ball. Mirror, mirror, which is right here. Memory. The usual memory game. Mega Brain Switch. Again. Meatloaf. Oops, sorry. And this is... I'm not really sure what that is. Signature. It's another card game. Last word, Sudoku. And uh, this is another fossil game. This is Panic Lift. It is a game where you have to be the elevator guy and you have to bring all the people down to the right floor. Let me just show you what that one is. It's really fun. It's really hard to do, actually. So it's like this. And if you miss one, you lose the game, basically. Punching con... Poppling contest, skeleton skull, snake, spider. So it's like a cake game of some sort. T Rex memory match, wall breaking, wreck housekeeper, whack the wolf, and yelling ten triceratops. I'm going to show you Whack the Wolf real quick because it's kind of like Whack-A-Mole. And for some reason the music has some kind of Pop Goes the Weasel music. So that's pretty interesting to me. I don't know what other game has that. I think it's very weird to hear that music while you're playing this. So it's very interesting and a little bit weird. But it's a really interesting game to play on here. Actually really good this game. I got like a lot of scores on here. Very awesome game. Try not to hit, hit a little bit of Riding Hood, though. So, that's the portable game I have here. I hope you enjoyed this episode, even though it's a bit minor. I can't really show you how to play the games officially because, um, um, I have a hard time actually filming this and putting this on here at the same time. I just wanted to show you real quick how fun this game, act, this portable thing actually is. And it's good to have it on vacation or whatever if you want to play something that's just simple and easy. So, I hope you enjoyed this um, little tutorial about this, and I'll see you next time. I hope you like this game. Leave a like if you actually like this game. And comment below if you, told, if you ever played this thing before. If you have, tell me your stories about them. So, I'd like to know. So, see you next time.